Good afternoon and welcome to our next video in our Near Mean and Nutshell series. I'm delighted to be joined by Dr. Paul Bowen today, General Practitioner from Dollar Health Centre in Clackmannanshire. Uh, and uh, Paul is going to be speaking to us about his use of Consult Now. Good afternoon, Paul, and could you briefly tell us uh, how you've been using Consult Now in your practice? Hi, Mark. I've been using the Consult Now feature in NHS near me for a few months. This function is really useful. So I'd encourage everyone to try it out and give it a go. Thank you, Paul. And is there a particular use where Consult Now has been uh, particularly helpful? It's particularly helpful when it would be useful to be able to see someone or to see part of their body. For, for instance, last week I had a telephone consultation with a man who developed a swelling over his arm. He was having difficulty estimating how large the swelling was or even telling me the exact location of the swelling on his arm. I considered bringing him down to a face to face appointment at the health centre, but instead I decided to use Consult Now. And it was really good. It enabled me to see that this was a fluctuant swelling. It was over his elbow joint. It didn't look red or infected. And, you know, I thought it was consistent with something called an alerconin bursitis. And so we could then discuss the diagnosis and management plan over a video call. And importantly, I, I was reassured that he didn't require any antibiotics, didn't require an aspiration. And using the Consult Now feature at that time allowed this man to start his treatment quickly. And it also meant that I could use the face to face appointment that I would have given him for someone else. That's great. Thanks for that. So a really good um, description of how Consult Now can quickly escalate from a telephone call to, to a face to face. Um, and Paul, can you tell me what's the impact been on your practice of using Consult Now? I think it's just given us another tool to use. It's, you know, it's, a, a, it's another addition to the options that we are able to offer people um, in terms of consultations. It's not something that I need to use often, um, but there have been several occasions when it's been really helpful to, um, and enabled me to make a diagnosis or to come up with a management plan without the need for the patient to attend the surgery. Thank you, Paul. And have there been any particular challenges and do you have any solutions uh, for those? So occasionally there have been glitches um, which are usually related to the, the browser that the patient is using on their phone. Um, I found that people who are using Google Chrome, for instance, it doesn't seem to work as well for them as people that use Safari. Um, but on the occasions that this happens, patients are usually able to copy and paste the link into another browser. Um, but generally, the majority of people that I've invited to use Consult Now have managed to use it OK. Thanks, Paul. That's a, a really useful tip. Uh, and finally, do you have any particular messages for colleagues who may be considering using Consult Now as a tool in their practice? So what I've done is I've added near me as a bookmark on my internet browser. Um, that means that I can log into the Dollar Health Centre waiting area quickly. My username and password is remembered, so I don't need to type that in every time I want to use it. And using the Consult Now function is, is very easy. It appears as a prominent tab on the screen. Probably takes me about 30 seconds to launch Consult Now to send the link to the patient's mobile um, or email address. I, I find it easier using the mobile number because I'm usually calling a mobile number when I want to convert to to video and then the patient receives a link which they can click on and takes them directly to consult now. Excellent, thank you Paul. That's again really good account of uh, how quick and simple and easy it is to, to engage with somebody via video. So um, at the end of this video here you will uh, find some more resources and links out to additional videos and um, online support for you in your practice. Uh, thank you again to Dr Paul Bowen and, and thank you very much for watching this afternoon. Goodbye.